Holy smokes, it's cold out there. My nose is bright red. What are you two doing in here? It's slime. More slime? Slime. We're bored. You put an ice cube in there? I'm keep it nice and cool. Good morning, everybody. We are so glad you're here hanging out with us today. This morning we are getting some breakfast going before the girls have to go to school. The boys do a school at home today. So they're still in bed. Claire and Carmen are getting some breakfast. We've got a little bit of, what? Avocado French toast? Not French toast. Oh, like French toast. <laughs> Just toast, sorry. My brain's not working yet, it's still too early. Carmen's having a muffin. Which kind are you having, Carmen? Poppy seed. Poppy seed. Mmm. Those are my favorite. All right, you girlies, quickly eat. Even though it's really, we're running behind. <laughs> as soon as I get the girls off to school, I'm gonna head to the gym. I've made it a goal to try and hit the gym or work out here at home six days a week. And so far, I'm doing pretty good with that goal. So hopefully I can keep it up and start seeing the results that I wanna see. Did you eat all your breakfast? Are you sure? Is your belly gonna be full all day? At least until lunchtime. <laughs> okay, if you're sure, go get dressed. Okay. Claire, how'd your toast turn out? Good. Looks yummy. Claire loves avocado toast. <laughs> Soon after. Today has completely flown by. The kids are already home from school, and Carmen's doing homework. Claire never has homework. She gets everything done at school, so, which is nice. Helps me out. I don't have to worry about it. She gets it done at school, so I'm gonna sit down here, help Carmen with her homework. She has a little bit more to do before she can go out and play. Today's been very, very busy. I have had a ton of housework to get done. Laundry, I went to the gym, which is awesome. I'm glad I got that in today. But um, it's just been kind of one of those days. So, Carmi. What? What you working on here today? Um, homework. I know, what do you have for homework? I have to write um, about what I read. So you have to read for 30 minutes and then you have to write three or four sentences about it, right? Yeah. What book are you reading right now? The, well, I've already read all the Dogman and so I'm reading them over again. How many times Two. have you read the Dogman books? Um, this is gonna be my second time. Your second time? Yeah. So you're rereading the whole entire series? Yeah. Because you got most of the series for Christmas, right? Yeah, I just need to get the seventh one from. Have you read the seventh one before or no? No. Oh, we'll have to get that one because we have it at Walmart, huh? How I read all it's really weird. Went from one to four to three to two to five to six. Why did you read them like that? <laughs> well, because I had to borrow books, get books, and then get the whole series. Oh, I see. So you couldn't get them in order. Yes. I see. So I had to get the first one, then I got the fourth one, but I didn't know that the fourth one was the fourth one. I thought it was the second one. But then I looked at the back and it said that this was the first, and then I was like, oh, nuggets, that this is the fourth. <laughs> and so I was like, okay. Sounds like I'm gonna have to get Carmen some more books to read. I thought she needed the whole series for Christmas. So we asked Santa for that, and come to find out. I only needed the fifth one. <laughs> She's read them all already, so we're gonna have to find you some new no, books to read. I, what series do you want to read next? I really want to read the Choose Your Own Happy, Happily Ever After. Oh, okay. Is that a series? Yeah. Rose, my friend, she says that there's like a hundred books. A hundred books? Almost. Whoa. Well, that'll keep you busy for a because while. She, and the books are like this thick. Whoa. And that'll definitely keep you busy And she for got a while. the whole series for Christmas. Oh, well, that's awesome. All right, she is all done with her homework. She's now gonna run out and play a little bit with Claire. Yes. And where are you going? I'm going to Brexton's house. You're gonna go play with Brexton for a little bit? Yeah. Okay, sounds good. Owen's just downstairs hanging out. He got all of his schoolwork done today. Like I said, the boys do um, at home learning on Wednesdays. So he's downstairs. Austin's out hanging out with his friends. And I'm just gonna finish cleaning up before it's time to get dinner going. <laughs> I just got home from work, and before I left to work, I told Owen to clean out the garage. Uh, we got some garbage in there that's kind of piling up. 
And as I came through the garage, home from work, I noticed that uh, it did not get done. Is there a reason, Mr. I had Oyster? Schoolwork. You had schoolwork all day. I'm, I'm having a hard time believing that you have not had five minutes to go. I forgot. The garbage. Oh boy. Guess what we're doing after dinner? Not doing that. <laughs> we are cleaning out the garage as soon as dinner is we over. We or you? Oh, you. Actually, we was the wrong word. You. You already uh, said we. No. Uh, you Actually, might, you, you I, might, I might be able to help you. There's some big boxes in there. And we'll work as a team. How's that sound? Better. All right, sounds good. Carm, what? you ready for dinner? Yeah. Are you excited for dinner? Kind of. Are you having chicken or are you gonna have just a BLT? We're doing chicken BLTs. Chicken BLTs. Well, what do you think? Well, it's up to you, right? You could forgo the chicken and just go with the normal BLT. I'm going with my regular chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. Sounds good to me. Claire, you doing all right over there? Yeah. All right, you hungry? All right, come get some food. We almost forgot that Owen had mutual tonight, so he was actually saved. He doesn't have to haul garbage. However, we're gonna find some other chores for him to do. But that leaves the ladies to help dad haul the garbage. Terry, don't you be trying to run off like you always do. Whatever. The chores start and you just like hide. I know, I'm totally kidding. Just Lies. wanted to see your reaction. <laughs> but Carm and Claire, guess what? We are gonna haul garbage because Owen didn't do it earlier. How do you guys feel about that? Yay! Yay! <laughs> I was expecting a different reaction. But but a sarcastic yay works. Turn back around. <laughs> Get some shoes on. We're gonna need a jacket. Claire, we're gonna have to put the slime away just for a it's little bit. Too Is that cold. all right? I'm sorry. It's not too cold. I'll get hypothermia. Get a jacket on. You've already, nope, you don't have boots on. Boots on. And let's go to the garage. Let's get her cleaned up. No, we're not gonna get hypothermia. We're not gonna be out there that long, and it's not that cold. It's gonna be fine. All right, let's go. Dogs, are you gonna help? No, probably not. But I know you are. Yeet. You just yeet it up there. There's so much garbage out here that's piled up. Luckily, we have the dump trailer close by for this other job. Good job, Carmen. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, where did that go? <laughs> did you it out? Sorry, can you throw it in that box right there and try to keep it organized? Good job, Claire. What about me, Terry? Good am job, do, Clay. Am I doing a good job? Thanks. Too <laughs> cold. Uh, oh, we gotta go to the other garage real quick. Uh, it is cold. Way too cold. We got a milk box just for you. Costco box. That's about it. Holy smokes, it's cold out there. My nose is bright red. What are you two doing in here? It's slime. More slime? Slime. We're bored. Oh bored, my. Bored, bored. Car, how are we you? We have enough slime to last us years. Let's make the rest of this and then we can go to the store and get more. No. It's like finding your crap. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't work that way, Dad. Here's this you girls are lucky you did not get my lotion tonight. Super lucky. Getting super tired of having to go to the store to get more gold bond. It's time we use mom's lotion. <laughs> Put ice cube in there? I'll keep it nice and cool. Oh, oh. oh no. No clean it up. Let's get some rags. Yeah. Carmen just spilled it water everywhere. Ice cubes on the ground, on the table, on the chair. On everything. I didn't know that uh, slime took water. Dad, just we a little. Take water, slime takes water. Oh, okay. Climb gets a little bit more. Because she spilled it. Oh, yours is super soupy. Mine's like really thick. Because really you added a lot of water. Dad, this is 
really easy mess to clean up. It is, it looks like a huge mess. Yeah, but it's really easy to clean up. As you can tell, my area is more clean. That is very true. Carmen's cleaning it though, with her slime. The girls are done with slime, thankfully. I'm done with slime. I've been done with slime for years, but yet we still <laughs> seem to be making it on a daily basis around here. Um, guys, today I spent an hour and a half on the phone with GoPro with their customer support. I've got a GoPro that's uh, having some issues. This one right here. Uh, it was on top of my helmet while I was dirt biking and I went under a tree that was kind of laying over like this and I kind of squatted down. However, I didn't go down far enough and the tree hit the GoPro, but it hung on, it was on my helmet. So it's been having some issues since then, as you guys can imagine. Um, they want me to send it back to them because they're gonna send me a new one. And uh, they said to send it in a smaller box. I can't find a small box, except I found a Kleenex box <laughs> right here. It's the perfect size, this thing will go right inside. However, I need something to protect it. And in the spirit of that, I've got this Norwal right here. The Norwal, we're gonna open this bad boy up, slip the GoPro inside. What do you think? <laughs> you think they're gonna laugh at GoPro? Uh, they're gonna think you're a weirdo. And then we're gonna ride on the Norwal GoPro inside. <laughs> I think it'll be funny. Let's uh, fillet open this uh, Norwal. Poor Mr. Norwal. He's gonna sit on the shelf somewhere at GoPro at their headquarters, I know it. <laughs> We're gonna have to take a little bit of this stuffing out of here. All right, time to put the GoPro in there. Should I put some tape around the Norwal or just put the GoPro in there like that? What do you think? Just have the GoPro in there. They'll never find it if you tape it up. Let's put him in the uh, Kleenex box. He's gonna fit just perfect in there, all oval shaped and whatnot. Let's close this. Safety first. Package is all ready to go. I hope somebody at GoPro gets a good laugh out of the Norwal. He's just there in case somebody tries to pull an Ace Ventura and kick it down the hallway. <laughs> Mr. Norwal is gonna protect Mr. GoPro. Uh, I know it's already kind of beat up a little bit, but we wanna just protect it as much as we can because I'm sure they're gonna try to refurbish it, right? I'll fix it up, so somebody else. Probably. They're gonna get me a brand new one though, which I'm excited about. Sweet, a GoPro 9 or an 8? It's an 8, oh. but eventually we'll probably get some GoPro 9s, so. Well, sweet, I'm excited to have two GoPros again. Yeah, I know, I know, we need it. So Ter, I'm gonna need some help dropping off Mr. Norwal tomorrow. Can you help me with that? Possibly. When UPS asks you what's in it, what are you gonna tell them? I I'm a little embarrassed to drop this <laughs> off, to be honest with you. Oh, don't be embarrassed. <laughs> like, um, ma'am, do you honestly expect to make this, or this is gonna make it all the way to California? Of course like it is. Uh, so are you gonna be like, hey, so this is a Kleenex box, there's a Norwal in here, and a GoPro. This eight. is all my husband. No, no, don't, don't, don't bring do me into it. <laughs> it. Don't bring me into it. You just tell him what's inside. Clay McNeil, he's the one that did this. You just tell him what's inside. <laughs> You know, like it's no big deal. Like everybody <laughs> ships something inside a Norwal. Totally normal. Totally normal. Yeah. Guys, we will let you know if GoPro sends back anything funny <laughs> with my new GoPro. So, I hope they do. It would be great if they have a sense of humor, it would right? Be great. <laughs> Super funny. So we will keep you guys updated on that, you guys. Tomorrow or the next day, we've got to head to Wyoming and I've got to put some cabins in for Terry's mom. So I think they've got quite a bit of snow up there. Probably gonna need some snowmobiling, maybe a little bit of tubing. Uh, maybe some tubing behind the snowmobile <laughs> and uh, a few things like that. So it should be a great weekend. Uh, stick with us. We love you guys. We'll see you guys back here tomorrow.